I used to investigate homicides for a living. You got to track down everything. Publicists aren't that well loved. Well, not loved, but I mean to pump five shots into this woman as a hit. I don't know, uh, Geraldo. I just would. You have to look at every aspect. You have to see who her enemies are. You have to track that all down. But then you also, with your gang intelligence, you have to find out what was going on with the gangs again. These gangs are very influential. I, I agree, but Beverly Hills is not the usual turf, but I'm glad they seized the computer. But let me bring in Joel Diamond, uh, not close to Ronnie Chasen, but uh, kind of a rival. You know her, Joel. Uh, first of all, do you want to comment on her uh, untimely demise? Well, yeah, I mean, it's, the whole thing's kind of strange. When I heard about it, um, I didn't know her that well, but uh, I certainly know a lot of other publicists very well, and I sort of would have thought I would have not been that surprised with some of the other ones. <laughs> um, it, 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 you you know, may have done it yourself and the other ones, eh, Joel? No, I'm just, uh, <laughs> yeah. I hate to bring in dark yeah. humor here, but uh, so, uh, you know, she no, had no, enemies, so we're, we're, clearly. Well, we're living, hey, obviously we're living in a land of make-believe, and this wasn't make-believe anymore. And this really, really happened. And uh, you know what they say? It, this is the only town in uh, the world you could, but you could die of encouragement. You know, so she had very sensitive and delicate information about somebody, and somebody was a little ticked off, and it happened. Craig, what's your... I don't think it was a random hit. Craig, what's your buzz? Um, you know, it, it, it would have been a difficult hit to make, considering the fact that this car has very small windows that would have had to have shot out of a, uh, a passenger side into those windows down. They're saying that the bullets went down into her car. So the theory so, was stop uh, there. So they're it, saying that it was a, a larger car, like an SUV, shooting down into right. the Mercedes driver's window. Exactly. And that all five so, shots uh, hit. All five shots hit. Uh, from Sunset Boulevard, then she would have had to drive uh, a quarter mile to where the car finally came to arrest. So it's a, there's a lot of questions that haven't been answered uh, by the police, but perhaps they're withholding that ev evidence, trying to find out who the perps really are. And, but finally, uh, Bo, the, the problem is where you don't have a clear motive, you're all over the place, yeah, you, unless the electronic search comes up with a lead. Well, yeah, that's this the whole could thing. be one of those unsolved mysteries that John a, Wall Street you talked about. You take, you take a blackboard out, Geraldo, you write different aspects, people who are angry with her, people who have threatened her, this, that. And when you're all finished with everything, then you have to use the, the variables. But a million dollars can loosen a lot of... Well, lives. a million dollars, even if it was a gang member. All of a sudden, a million dollars, a guy knows about uh, my friend there that whacked somebody in Beverly Hills, that will all come up. A million dollars will make a lot of people talk. Plodito, thank you. Joel Diamond, thanks. Uh, Craig, thank you as well. The Beverly Hills Police is, uh, Department is urging anyone with information on this crime to call the detective tip line. The number is 310-288-2656. I'll say it again because we don't have a super up. 310-288-2656.